These kids aren't this excited because they're about to see pop sensation Justin Bieber. Nope, they're psyched for science. Okay, time's up, everybody. People would wave signs and stuff. It's an incredible atmosphere and it's almost like a concert. The over 206th and 7th graders are taking part in an interactive game show for the All Science Challenge here at UBC. How many elements are in set A? We did a lot better than I expected us to, so that was really fun. And also um, having everyone cheer, uh, like the people in our class for us, but also hearing everyone. All right, it sounds like you guys are getting some right. <laughs> The All Science Challenge was developed by volunteers at Let's Talk Science, a national science outreach organization. Three, two, one. Okay, everybody, time's up. After the lively game show, the students get into smaller groups for a hands-on task and a little friendly competition. Right now we're working on a bridge and we're trying to build the longest bridge and make it so that it can support a glass filled with water. Yes. Yes. Wow. Yes. 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 We got sticky notes, cups, um, some tape, and a whole bunch of other things. Okay, well then the, ridi sticky the, ri the ridiculously sticky stuff. Well, one of the fun things is, well, particularly here, is we get to talk about what we're going to do, and we all get to add our ideas like, oh, my idea is this. Oh yeah, that sounds great. Uh, why don't we modify it this way? And we were like jumping up and down from like what we're going to do next. I know that depending on the setting and um, what the tasks you're given in science, it can actually be incredibly fun. Everything has a science to it if you look at it. So then that's, that's like the bridge here. There's obviously a lot of science going into that. Oh, it's not there. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, oh okay. So I think this package of, of the quiz show and the activities really brings out the best in everyone. Along the way, the kids are mentored by UBC students who volunteer their time. Sam Lee says seeing the kids this excited reminds him why he chose a career in science. In the lab, it's a lot of redundant work that you do over and over again, but then in here, you sort of get a different environment, you work with different people, and it just really reminds us of why we got into science in the first place. It's the joy of, of exploring and just curiosity. When you set it up this way, where there's an element of competition and then a hands-on component, then they're very excited about science. It's pretty obvious the day-long science adventure has inspired these kids. We may well be looking at the next generation of engineers, teachers, and scientists. I think I'm going to be a teacher. So I might teach science. Seeing that science can be this interesting and I would like to one day maybe build a real bridge. This, we don't want it to be orange. I'm Bianca Salterbeck in Vancouver for The Express. Well,